the basic financial argument around clean energy remains strong. It costs three times as much to put a solar panel on your roof in this country as it does in Australia or the EU, all of which is absurd. This should be as easy as putting a new refrigerator in your house. We're used to thinking of this as the whole foods of energy, nice but pricey. It's really the cost go of energy. It's cheap, it's available in bulk, it's on the shelf ready to go. The reaction of the oil industry and the Trump administration is proof in its way of just how powerful this technology is. Look, they're realists. They know they're not going to hold off sun and wind forever, but they'll settle for holding it off for a decade or two. That wouldn't be the end of the world if it weren't for the end of the world, if it wasn't overlapping with the exact decades where we absolutely have to do something about the climate crisis. We're now in a dramatically dangerous moment in Earth's history. We have really screwed things up, um, but I don't think the final verdict's been written yet.